This is an underwater robot for carrying out inspections underwater. It has various end effectors such as the robotic arm, corrosion testing probe, fishing nets and also sand sample collector and the water sample collector that are switchable for various applications. It has a Kevlar body that withstands high pressures, it has 6 degrees of freedom. The hydrodynamic design pr produces less drag compared to the existing systems in the market. We are controlling it with this radio controller and the radio has been controlled through wired. So this will be controlling the ROV throughout the journey. So we have six powerful motors here that will be able to produce among seven to eight kilograms of thrust. We are also having a high definition camera that will display the everything underwater that are visible. In addition, if the water is murky and unclear, this sonar will produce sonar imaging. With that, we'll be able to image what are the objects that are underwater and not visible in the camera. Three translation motions such as forward and backward, sideways, upward and downward can be achieved with the four motors over here. And three uh, rotational motor motions such as pitch, roll and yaw with 360 degree can be achieved with these two motors that have been used here. The user interface have been made very easy that everything has been controlled with these two, two sticks alone. The camera feed and the sonar part and the position of the ROV all combinedly can be displayed with the web page that we have developed here. Personal feedback that we have got from individual mentors by the weekly reviews that they have conducted on a regular basis, it has helped us to improve our product week by week. First, work the math properly, take the calculations, the buoyance effect and other physical stuff that could be possibly affecting the drone underwater and then design it, simulate it on the relevant environment in any simulation software such as uh, Gazebo or uh, ANSYS. Take the results and outputs as a feedback, make the thing better, change the design, explore more, take your time and then get into uh, prototyping it Get and then get into fabrication part. Working the simulation and the math properly would help us to prototype it properly in a cost effective manner and within a mean time. Basically, the lab promotes interdisciplinary projects where uh, people from different departments will work together. Our lab is uh, accessible for everyone in our college at any time. This is our second consecutive year in the, here in the finals at IIT Bombay. Last year's jury panel member has contacted us and showed his interest in our product. And now we are in talk with him to get funded from him to bring this product into the market. He's also connecting us with the government officials to, as our project was related to waste management. In the regional finals at Coimbatore, Tamil Nadu, we met a person who was the participant in Eantra's first robotics challenge edition. He sparked the ignition in us to begin a startup. So we incubated our uh, project in our college. Certifications like uh, patenting our idea and uh, registering our startup through a, a proper manner in Startup India portal and uh, bringing uh, mo more uh, variations and researches on this and publishing more publications on the research that we have done, the literature uh, survey that we have done. Eantra was one of the main reasons for our startup initiation.